Good afternoon. I'm Morgana Stanley, the superintendent of the Henderson County Schools. Yesterday, Governor Andy Bashir recommended that all public schools and private schools across the state of Kentucky close for at least two weeks to help control the spread of the coronavirus, COVID-19. We are following the governor's recommendation and closing in-person classes until March 27th. Our students will continue with their classwork through the state's non-traditional instruction program. Your students' teachers have told them what kind of work they will be doing over the next two weeks and how to get in touch with them if they need help. We are encouraging our families to make sure that their child is completing their work and help, that helps make sure that educational process doesn't stop. Our teachers will be available during the two weeks, Monday through Friday from nine to two. We will also keep modified hours at our central office and at our schools between the hours of nine and two as well. Another important point to remember during this unprecedented time is that the Kentucky Department of Public Health is asking all Kentuckians to stay away from large crowds, something known as social distancing. There will be no community use of our buildings, no club activities, practices, games, or family events, or any school activities or sponsored trips during this time. Our child care centers will close between March 16th and March 27th. We ask that you keep your children from gathering together with their friends in large groups, places such as the mall or going to the movies. It's most important for our children with chronic disease such as asthma or diabetes, or those who are at the most highest risk. Our child nutrition department is in the process of making plans to receive at least one meal per day in a um, program called Grab and Go. And this will be available, more information will be available on our district website and through school parent links. Our district will provide weekly communications to students and to families in our district through the website, social media, and parent links. We appreciate your patience and understanding and the support of our school system as we maneuver through this very different time. Thank you.